Yeah, we're here. We're here. Sorry, guys. Hello. Hi. 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 I came. I dressed. I tweeted. Oh, hey. That's right. You were the bad guy. That's cool. No, nobody else dressed for me. But, uh, so, I'm here for you. So no, I, this is a great <laughs> now, I understand, I understand you may not be able to say much about season three, but we kind of know that you have the big bad now. So, and like, because YouTube in the show has had a lot of, you know, friction, tension, and so on. Now that you're the big bad, and you know, is it how did that then I'm be between these two? Because you know, you're kind of. You know, never is too Well, big bad. I don't know. There's. I think there's going to be a lot of labels here that uh, Rook <laughs> might object to. Uh, I don't think that he's the villain. I think that he's the, the anti-hero. And I think that uh, he feels like this is all coming from, from a good place. Um, and look, <laughs> look, Shield. <laughs> how many times has Coulson been wrong? I mean, there there are a million things that that Shield uh, could do better. And every yin needs its yang. And uh, so I don't think the word is sitting there with a cat and twirling a mustache. And Maybe it's a dog that he had a head. No, a dog. Did, that he did not kill. Um, That's but questionable. No, you know, it, there's a history with, with Hydra about Nazism and world domination and all that stuff. And, and that's, you know, this, this is a new Hydra. Uh, you know, we're, we're rebranding. What so, is your purpose for Hydra? That is something that season three will answer. Make is he going to have a family. team of Inhumans with him? His own team of Inhumans against... I mean, look, who knows? Who knows? There was also, I was tweeted a picture with a Raptor Squad behind me. Uh, when <laughs> I've Jurassic seen that picture. World came out. Yeah, exactly. Um, no. <laughs> we will see. We'll oh. just have to see. At the end of season one and the end of season two, Coulson and May have found themselves at odds for almost the exact same reason. Right. How do you see that going forward? Have they made up? We didn't really see a real reconciliation. Have they? Are they no, back? No, I mean, I think you see May needing to take a little break, taking a little vacation, and trying to figure out her personal life with Andrew that she almost gave up. I think Andrew was the love of love her life, and, and to have him come back into her world, uh, it's, it's going to be a struggle for her, I think, between that and going back into S.H.I.E.L.D. Because as much as she is the soldier and willing to do anything for S.H.I.E.L.D., I think there's a part of her that is questioning, you know, who's right and who's not right. Although she knows for sure that Hydra is completely <laughs> That's a tentacle high five. That's <laughs> <laughs> but you know, I mean, anything can happen. It's, that's what's so amazing about our writers. That uh, who knows, you know, if May gets convinced by War, that who knows? Who knows? I doubt it very much, but. That's the, that's the beauty. There's, there really is just more gray than black and white. Mm -hmm. For sure. So, you, you have you both kind of, may have been specifically uh, had a hand in two very uh, big life changing moments. Oh, had a hand? <laughs> oh, that's a good way to put it. <laughs> Or a big nail. Interesting <laughs> use of words. So is this Hydra turn more about the making shield in general, or is it more specifically directed at getting at getting Meg? At getting Meg. Spider-Man. Ooh, that is a good question. Um, uh, huh. <laughs> <laughs> well, the whole Agent 33 demise is pretty May. May specific, but also, I mean, if you look back in uh, season one, the first 16 episodes before we found out that he was a spy, he's questioned, and that's why he was brought in the first place, risk assessment. He also makes some weird decisions. You know, sometimes he, he, he just thinks from his heart and, uh, and kind of makes decisions sometimes that don't make a lot of strategic sense. So I think that there's there's a built-in um, uh, 
because they operate in different ways. So, um, that being said, I think that um, they might find themselves uh, fighters uh, to each other. Uh, you know, Hydrated? <laughs> no, to be perfectly honest, though, we also have really just, just, just started. We have one or two breadcrumbs to, to, to go with. We know that the writer is amazing and they're going to do some incredible stuff, but um, we haven't even started production. We haven't. We don't have the first shot at the camera. There's, there's nothing there yet. So we have Your guess is about as much information as you do. Yeah. It will be exciting. <laughs> I think we have to wrap it up, I'm sorry. Might have to be a costume award, maybe. Maybe a uniform of some sort. Or would you want one? A uniform? Yes! Absolutely, are you kidding me? Isn't this the uniform right here? I'm leather the leather. Jacket? What do you guys think? Yeah, well, the leather works for you. I, I think it's, it's a nice like you uniform. Wore in the finale, though, but I'm like, I just want to leave like a white shirt and a yellow jacket or something like that. You should die if you're red. <laughs> totally. No hydra. Guys, two eye patches. <laughs> <laughs> For the title, it might be worth it, but maybe not. <laughs> and we will make sure it's out there. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. The title of this thing. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs>